Hello everyone, it's Robin here and welcome, welcome. I'm excited to see you all today. Happy Memorial Weekend. I always love this weekend for, you know, the fact that it's Memorial Day, but it's also my birthday this weekend. So I always get to celebrate some extra days. So that's always fun. So today we'll be doing a plan with me in my classic vertical happy planner. And I'm excited because I'm gonna pair the stickers from Desert Thistle. These are happy planner stickers. I'm in love with these stickers and the colors in here along with some of the washi tape I received from the washi tape shop that I picked up these are the girls and I have one in particular you may notice her right here I'm really excited about this so let's flip the camera down and get to planning today we're planning for the week of May 27th my birthday through June 2nd and I'm super excited about this plan with me so I just want to get right into it. I'm wondering if I'm going to want some washi, but we'll pull some in as we pull these out. I am using, well, let me show you. This is my inspiration sticker here. Look at these girls. This is from the washi tape shop. Look at all these girls on here. Aren't they cute? Oh my gosh, I love them, but I really love her. So I'm just going to cut her out right away. So this washi tape is wide and it has a backing on it, so it's really like a sticker. So I'm gonna cut it here and move that aside. And I'm gonna cut around the florals so we don't have those necessarily in there. But the washi tape shop washi is really nice. It has, uh, it's, it's very thin and gorgeous. I'm gonna cut these flowers off here too because we're just gonna use this girl. I love her in her wide leg denim. She just looks so cool. Okay. I don't know, I might need to neaten that up here in the corner, but we'll see. Because I'm gonna set her right here, but I can use that straight edge. She might go over a bit, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and wipe this note out so that doesn't show through and let's get her on the page. So you just pull the backing off and you can see, you can kind of see through this, it's paper thin. Isn't that pretty? And we're gonna set her right across the bottom here. I'm gonna use this line. She can dip down a bit, it's all good. And she can go over the line a little bit too. Just like so, yes! I'm already loving this spread. Okay, so let's look at this situation so it has all these flowers in it and there are some gold but i really want these colors here and i think i'm going to use these aren't they fun super fun and i really enjoyed last week how i set it up where i was really doing a row of lists during the day and then i had a box and then a decor i'm going to do something similar but i'm not going to put them in rows i'm going to mishmash them each day i'm going to use these stickers here so i think i want to stay in these warmer colors and leave pink out of it so let's just let's just start they all say noted and i'm going to use these as my boxes now this is where i'm thinking i might want washi we're just going to put these down and then figure it out so i'm going to put this box right here right up at the line just like so Nice. And then this box down low in the next column, just like so. And let's put this one up at the top. What do we want this one? I think we want this one up here. So I have them in every kind of, not every other row, but so none of them go in line with each other. So boom, 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 and then we'll go here and here. And then I'll have to figure the weekend out. But it's okay, because it's the weekend, it's a little different. We'll go there, and then we'll put this green one right down here at the bottom. Okay. Nice, and from that is how we can build it. So I have box, 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 and then I have to do something over here. Okay, 
we're off to a good start. I think I'm gonna pull in some washi. I like this one, it's really skinny. It has some star sparkles in it in kind of a rose gold. I think the color, while it's not the same, definitely blends and I'm going to just washi right across the tops of these lines. So let's do that. Okay, I think that looks really nice. So what I wanna do since I mixed these up, I'm going to do checklists and I'm gonna do the same thing with them and I'm also gonna do the same thing with the decor. So we should have a nice variation of design. So let's work on that. I found these circle stickers and I think I'm gonna use these. So if we went here, 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 I'm gonna put one here and then here and Let's pull, yeah, let's pull, let's pull these reminder stickers. But what I'm gonna do is trim the top off. Now they do look different than the noted, but it's also the weekend. So you can kind of get by with that a little bit. Let's put this blue up at the top here on a Saturday. We'll just line this up here. It has a similar look to it, although it's different, but it is the weekend. Let's grab this other reminder, trim the top off of this, and put it straight here. Okay. I think that's kind of cute. Okay, perfect. Um, let's go ahead and put our lines in. So to keep it kind of organized, I think I'm gonna do my lines above these and then it'll go down here since it would be here and that will make it easy. I have this gel pen with a similar color palette. So let me grab my stencil. Here is my Happy Planner stencil and I'm thinking, I wonder how many lines I wanna put in. So if I line it up about here, one, two, three, four. I'll do five lines. Five lines seemed to work last week, so let's do that again this week. This just makes a, such an easy planner spread. I love this. So now we have decor here, 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 here and here, which that's the fun part. I also want to put something up at the top of these, maybe as a header. So I don't know if I'll put the to-dos or if I'll put a design. We'll look at that. And I need something for the sidebar here. So let's figure those things out. Okay, so I have some ideas on the sidebar, but I think I'm gonna put these flowers in, these open spaces so that I can see what it is going to look like. So the way they're in this page, some are upside, some are, uh, some are upside down and some are right side up. I kind of like that. I do have seven of them if I stay away from this pink one. And I don't know, I think we're just gonna go with it. I don't know if I'm gonna put them upside down or right side up, who knows? Who knows? Let's start with this red one here so I can keep this one away from this guy up here. I might want to just put them all straight up. They're going to go they're going to go wide. We're just going to see how this works. They're going to be all over the place. I think I might like this. I think I might like it a lot. Yes, let's go blue. I'm going to put blue here so it's not in the same realm. They all face the same way. So we're going to go this way and I'll try to stay away from my lines as much as possible in my checklists. That's fun. Let's grab the green one. I'll set her right here. Okay, this is really fun. I know it's touching these others, but I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. So let's figure out my color scheme over here. So I have these four with this light peach. Let's end with the blue. Hopefully we can get these colors to kind of work, right? We'll end here. Yes, gorgeous. And let's put the green one 
right here. Oh my gosh, this is really cute. This peach one's gonna have to go at the top, right about here. And then this rusty red one will fit right here. Look how much fun that is. So much movement going this way. Looks like waves. <laughs> so much fun. Okay, I just moved that one sideways a little bit. I'm enjoying this. So let's figure out what we're gonna do at the top of our checklist and our sidebar. Okay, I'm gonna pull one of these arch stickers because it's very similar to this. And I'm gonna put this over here, but I'm gonna go upside down with it. And we're gonna set this right at the top here, just like so. Oh yeah, that could be for the main things that I have happening this week. And I'm gonna pull in some of my script stickers. This is my functional script too. It has a this week and a remember and a this month. And I'm gonna pull a this week sticker and kind of put it right up here. I'm trying not to co cover that flower. I can put it right down here. And then I can put my top three things that I wanna do there. And I have a functional script sticker that has to-dos on it, but I made a new one. This is coming out in my next release. It'll be coming soon. There's a ton of to-dos on here. I haven't counted them, but there's a lot of them. And I'll be putting this on the shop. So I'll probably, I'll probably get this on the shop early in case you're looking for some to-do stickers. But I do like to just put these right on here like so. This little pop of black really does tie things in and uh, it helps you find your to-do lists. Okay, I have all those. That's looking pretty good. I'm really liking that. Do we need anything else? I don't want to fill up all the white space. I feel like I need just a little something. Let me go check things out. Let's play with these little deals in here. So there's one, I don't want the pink. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I want to put them up here. I could put one here. Let's take this big one, cut it in half, straight across the center, put one side here, and the other side right here. Okay, let's just place these in. Okay, oh my gosh, I just added a little color up here at the top and I think this looks fun. Let's get the planner and put her in. So this is kind of a fun spread and I'm looking forward to another easy week in terms of having places in my planner. I have a place to write my main goals for the week and I have a to-do list each day as well as a noted box and some decor. And I can even write in here if I really wanted to or around here. There's lots of fun places to write for sure. The Desert Thistle sticker book from Happy Planner is super pretty. I love the color palette of this. And I also love these stickers from the washi tape shop with the girls. I'll link all these down below if I can find them for you in case you're interested in checking any of these out as well as stickers from my Etsy shop that I use some functional script. Um, I am working on my sticker release for summer. It should be coming up soon. I'm very excited about it and I hope you are too. And um, I'll try to get this to do script up though beforehand because that's a lot of to do's and that is always a fun thing. What do you have going on next week? I would love to hear from you down in the comments below. Thank you all so much for joining me. I hope you have a magical day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.